after this gala, uh, uh, we will hope <laughs> uh, we can uh, help uh, to soldiers and uh, people who who need it. The National Ballet of Ukraine is touring Canada in a series of 22 performances across 10 cities to raise money and awareness for Ukraine amid the war. In Montreal, they're performing at the St. Denis Theatre four times until January 20th. The troupe of 150 dancers from the Taras Shevchenko Opera House is considered to be one of the world's top-ranked ballet companies. This is best dancers in uh, our theaters. This is a lot of solace, and uh, it's uh, uh, very seldom when uh, a theater traveling with uh, a lot of solace <laughs> together. What we're seeing a lot today in Ukraine is the deliberate destruction by, destruction by Russian forces of Ukrainian cultural sites. So this is everything from museums, concert halls. Um, and so what these grantsters are doing is really going across the country and preserving their culture, showing it to Canadians, and making sure that this stays alive. During the show, the National Ballet of Ukraine will perform excerpts of some of the world's greatest ballets, alongside spotlighting Ukrainian traditional dance. We have uh, many pieces. It's a uh, mm, great uh, mm, classical pieces uh, like Don Q and Corsar. We want uh, uh, to, uh, to show uh, emotion, uh, what people in Ukraine feel in today. The Cross Canada Tour is aimed at showcasing Ukrainian culture and raising funds for nonprofit organizations operating in Ukraine that provide crisis relief, refugee aid, and seed long-term projects to help rebuild the country. We've got millions of people displaced from their homes. Uh, we have hundreds have been killed, children's or children orphaned. We've got old people that have nowhere to sleep. So really getting money over there and getting it to the right place is hugely important right now. It's a horrible. It's uh, always scared. It's uh, always you thinking about everything, about your uh, loved person and uh, about the situation every second, every minute. I want to say thank you so much for all audience uh, who will be here today because uh, they are very support our country and uh, our dancers. In Montreal, Gareth Maddock-Jones, City News.